Hey there, how are you? Have you tried out the hide buttons feature from the command bar in Dynamics 365 and model driven power apps? My name is Jorge Daniel and in this video I will show you how to hide buttons without any code or third party solution. Editing the command bar and adding new buttons has been around for some time and it's a great feature. More recently, Microsoft made available the possibility to hide out-of-the-box buttons. Not all buttons can be hidden and there seems to be some technicalities that need to be addressed, but it's a step in the right direction. Also because the creator of the go-to tool for this kind of customization, Scott Duro, is now with Microsoft and that leaves us wondering what's in store for the Ribbon Workbench. Let's get to it. From your solution, edit your app and then click for options in the table you want to work with and edit command bar. You can now choose to edit the main grid, the one shown uh, when a table in the table view, the main form when working in a record, or the subgrid and associated views. Let's go with main grid for this one. And to hide the button, click the three little dots here and choose hide. As you can see, an icon is shown there to make you aware that the button is hidden. As I said, not all buttons will have the hide button, uh, the hide option, such as edit, but the product is ever evolving and let's hope they get to it soon. A common request you get is to either activate and deactivate buttons and you can now do that easily. Also, take a look at this action area here. You may not want to hide the buttons, but you may want to change their behavior. And this, along with the already mentioned ability to create new buttons, opens up a lot of possibilities. I will add a video or two on this soon, so please stay tuned. Great news, I think. What about you? What are your thoughts on this? Let me know what you think in the comments, okay? And see you soon!